Hello, I'm Old Nile. We haven't seen each other for quite some time. I've been busy with some real life projects here. For a change, it wasn't um, translation, but something else. Well, if you see my, if you have seen my channel, you probably know what it is. It's the Payday 2 mass stuff. But I decided to do something now. I um, kind of felt like coming back to the 2010 AVP, Alien vs Predator. This time we are going to have a brief look at the Alien, the Alien, um, well, missions, the campaign. So this is the second map that follows the uh, tutorial. Um, basically, the first map is about um, breaking free of like a testing area. You are an alien called uh, Subject 6 because you have shown promise and um, the researcher guys kind of took a liking of you. Like they found you interesting because you seem to be more intelligent than the rest of your species. And they included you into a research program and thus you became Subject 6 and eventually of course Due to the error of the humans, well, all hell broke loose, including you. And now we are going to crawl into a vent. Now you remember that the Marine campaign is, well, it's mostly about, well, you trying to survive, well, in this pretty much the same environment as, as a human, as a Marine soldier. And, well, it's tough. Because you have these killing machines as aliens who can pretty much see in the dark or whatever. They sense where their enemies are. They can crawl crawl onto any surface, pretty much seamlessly as you can see. Which I think yes, I am on the floor now. It's indicated by the little um uh, cursor in the middle. Because it's pointing downwards all the time. So you can climb stuff, um, can be a pretty stat little creature, and you need to, because, well, apart from your claws and your tail, you don't really have anything else in your repertoire. No guns, obviously. You also don't have, uh, like, that acid spit that you can see in some of the, I think, um, Alien Resurrection, I think it was where the, some of the aliens actually could spit acid. But you don't have that here. You're just a standard, well, kind of like aliens type of creature. So you're pretty agile, unlike the alien in the first movie. But, well, you have to get up close for the kill, I believe. Yeah, you need to kill this thing. Crawl up here. So yeah. So yeah, you need to be as stealthy in order to do stuff around here. I think I went around the whole place. So what was the point of coming here though? Let's see. Oh, I see. Oh. Well, that's great. I don't know how I did this. Also, how you haven't noticed me yet. I'm gonna grab you here. No hard feelings. Uh, can I have your brains, please? Oh, lovely. Okay, so that. Oh, other one. Terrific. Oh, bloodbath. Well, huh? Not really look like a type of person who just had their brains bitten out through their forehead. There's usually like a big bite mark, whatever. Probably went pro over here. So yeah, I probably should be more careful than that. I'm also playing this on hard difficulty right now. Just for a change. I usually play on normal, but... I mean, if you're stealthy enough in this, you can get by. And even if you aren't, like me, then still you have a pretty good chance of... Xenos don't like fire. Xenos, in fact, don't like fire. Okay. Well, I really need to be careful here. These guys have flamethrowers. Sneak around the room. No argument with that. There's probably another exit point somewhere here. 
Is the other guy following her or... Yeah. They stick together as proper marines should. Oh, okay. No death, thank you. I can't go any further. Hmm. I guess I'll need to lure them around a little. Hopefully separate them in some way. There's an exit point here. Okay. There we go. Back up on the floor. Roof, even. Alright. That guy. Wonder if they heard that. Or not. How about we don't have that light here? Hey. Can they seriously not hear me from over there? Hey. Yeah, lure them, lure one of them there, and take care of the other one from here. Crafty little fellow that I am. Hello. Sorry. Oh, other guy is coming. Not fun. Okay. Coming from this way. Let's go around. I mean, even if they notice you and fire at you, you're still a pretty agile creature, so there's a good chance you can get away. Mm, let's leave the flashlights to where they belong. That is the floor. Let's see this guy on the head. Hi. Lovely. Oh, you have the bite mark. Pretty huge one. How your eyeball even stayed there, I have no clue. Okay. Well, that just happened. Which way am I heading here? here. Ah. Checkpoint. What? Shiny on the outside, rotten on the inside. <laughs> ah, it's a good old roof game, or ceiling, sorry. A civilian there, a couple of guards, not too bad. Sometimes it's pretty hard to tell where you are on the map in jumping around and turning the world upside down as you crawl around the walls and ceiling can be a bit disorienting. Uh, the first time when I played, I at the end of the game, like after a couple of hours, I pretty much was like it's like a weird, unusual feeling, sort of discomfort, I guess could be motion sickness. I mean, it wouldn't be unjustified after all this. But yeah, it was pretty weird. It was also weird to play as the creature who I kind of had a, like a weird fear as a kid. But I guess it kind of helped to get over that. I mean, aliens are pretty cool. Just need to, well, learn a bit more about them and not just take them as a, like a weird killing machine of an organism. Uh. Can I get close to this guy? Yes, I can. Don't mind me as I crawl around the world. Oh, this guy is afraid, apparently. That guy just left? Okay, well. I apologize. Oh, oh. That's unfortunate. Oh. Don't mind the alien helping a face hugger out in main lead. Okay. I was. He pro 
probably should have investigated that noise. Peekaboo. No, don't, don't care. I'm pretty sure you can see me from here. So why are you not attacking me? Alright, fine. Be that way. Oh, boy, what's happening? Oh, he heard that one. Where is this guy? Dun, 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 dun. Look, it will only sting, only sting for a moment. Don't worry about it. Um, hmm. I guess this is where I'm supposed to be going. Okay. Let's not jump into that. I mean, aliens aren't exactly... Oh, hi. <laughs> Oops, okay. I don't know where I am. Never mind. Um. You are not allowed to down into the ground. Not even sure what I said there. Almost died as well. Need some of that. Some of these human nutritions here. Awesome nice brains. Okay. Close call that one. But managed to do it. Whoa, whoa, okay. I have a feeling I have to be careful here. These things turn around pretty slowly, but I assume if they hit me, that would be a bit painful. So let's not do that. Okay, where are we now? What's this way? Ah, Royal Jedi again. Kind of like the collectible of the Alien campaign. There is apparently there's a reward if you collect all of them throughout the campaign, but I'm not sure what it might be. Maybe like a reward for a multiplayer. Are you certain this home is secure? As secure as anywhere on this rock. Get to the garage. I'd rather end it myself than wind up like the others. Suit yourself. You Anything that? cool around here? Oh yeah, they can hear me clattering about Stand up down. here. Oh, no, obviously. So that's probably not too bad, not too bad to handle. Stand down. Yeah, don't worry about it. It's just me. Okay, guy looked away. <laughs> Apparently the civilian noticed me, but this guy didn't. So that's going to be his death. Hi. Don't worry about it. No, I might do this all the time. That guy is whimpering around in there. Oh. There. Kind of cool chair here. Let's have a little less light in here. Not that it matters. I mean, I think I'm pretty much done in here, except for this guy here. Let's open this. Oh. Um. Well, you probably did the sensible thing. Um. Wow. Okay, that must have been a high caliber right pistol if it just blow, blew your head clean off. Kind of selfish, if you ask me, but hey. Bunch of ammo here. What is that? 50. A 50 cal pistol? Or, well, I mean, in the alien world, that would be pretty much justified. You need a strong sidearm if, you, if you're up against, like, aliens on a regular basis. Hmm. Okay. Uh, maybe I have to uh, be careful. Here and do I have 
have to watch for this. No. Hello. Hi. Oh, right. Auto turret. Okay. Probably should be more aware of my surroundings. At least it dropped me off right here. Oh, okay, yeah, that was a pretty obvious line, sign that I failed to notice. Hmm. It's probably a way around this. I mean, knowing the alien games, there has to be an ah, elevator shaft. Um, ah, yeah. Whoop. Huh, we have arrived to the garage. Good afternoon. How are we all? Quite a few of them here, actually. That's nice. There's the auto turret. Well, I won't be going that way, I, I guess. Drop down behind this guy. No, not yet. Which one is alone here? Let's try this one. Hi. Oh, oh, no, that's still. Up. Oh, Jesus. Okay, okay. Oh, hello. What is that? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Just. Just your. Average killing machine running around on the ceiling. Don't let your guard down. Yeah, you really shouldn't. You worry about the civilian later. Then there aren't like half a dozen marines running around. Let <laughs> Let's drop down on top of this thing. Crawl down over here. And grab this guy. Well. Crafty little guy. Um, can I? Oh no, I can't. It's here. It's here. No, it's not. Don't worry. It's not. It's just that guy's imagination. Don't relax just yet, Marines. Yeah, they are Don't pretty aware yet, of their surroundings on hard difficulty, it would seem. Oh, at first I thought it was a power loader, but. Not exactly the same model. This has wheels. So it's a forklift, basically. Never mind. Mm. Dinner time? Come on. Hey. Mm. Maybe that one? Don't relax just yet. Don't a civilian there. Let's jump up here. Anyone wants to come in here? <laughs> yeah. That does not sound good. Sounded like it came from here. It really did. Fine. No. Oh, okay. Close call again. Sometimes it's really hard to tell where the stealth kill prompt appears and when it doesn't. I mean, yeah, she probably noticed me at the very last moment. Still could have done, still could have done a stealth kill there, but oh well. What if we lure one of them up here? Break this thing. Or in fact, break as many lights as possible. What's making all this light here? That's too far away, I guess. There we go. Make things a bit easier for us. Careful. Careful light. Can I? Oh, it's looking this way. What's going on here? Must be hearing things. 
there's a jelly canister there, by the way. There's a couple of them on the other side of the room, probably where I first tried to lure them. No, 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 that's not good. Don't relax just yet, Ruby. Like the fact how you can see your arms when, when you're when you're crawling around. Oh, this might be something to Hello. Really unfortunate. It's one less marine to worry about. I think there's like three of them remaining. Shouldn't be too bad to handle. area is pretty light. I mean lit, well lit. Mm. So there's that guy, there's this guy. What about the last one? is pretty separated from the rest. Let's be bold here. Hello! Let's just break this thing for good measure. And this thing. Oh yeah, it is. I guess this, that was the civilian. But... Is there more of them? I thought I heard someone from this area. But now they are cooped up in a... In a group. Whoa. Oh, that those guys. Huh. Yet, Do you want to come inside? What the hell was that? <laughs> Don't let your guard down. Classic horror movie trope. Something makes a scary noise. One of the group is like, I have to check that out. And in the Sounded next like moment he's like, <laughs> How's it going? That's not nice. I'm out. It also looks like that these flamethrower units can be stealth killed. I noticed that before. Actually, had to like go toe to toe with them. I guess they are like heavy units. Though I don't remember that being a thing on normal. Oh well. I won't jump on them with them being so close to them. Don't let you guard them. To each other, I mean. Okay, well, I guess you need some incentive to get separated again. How about one of you comes here? Okay. Careful does it. Round about here. Don't relax just yet, Marines. <laughs> I was afraid the other guy would come in if I moved in for the kill. Don't this guy's doing the moonwalk, down. apparently. You should probably stop that. Can I? Can I? Yes. Hi. I'll be back my tail. Yeah, very awesome, isn't it? Whoop. Ah, it's just the last guy. Can I really not do a stealth kill? There we go. For a moment I was scared that I was right in front of the auto turret. This is for all the discomfort you cause me. Now where is your civilian friend? Ah, there you are. I need you to propagate our species. Sorry. times I think that's probably the reason. Uh, harvest. 
thousand stealth kills, a couple. Yeah, I got some points deducted for dying. And so I guess it is possible to stealth kill like flamethrower units as well, because otherwise you wouldn't be able to do it on harder difficulties. I'm just not sure why it doesn't work when you do it from a wall, as it normally does with regular marines. But, oh well, that's just a side thing. So yeah, that was the second mission of the AVP 2010 Alien Campaign. Pretty enjoyable. And it runs pretty well too, so... I mean, it still is a pretty good looking game. No complaints there. And it runs pretty well and even on, on an average computer. Mine is like, I don't know, um, five years old on average. I mean, some of the parts are newer like the graphics card, but the processor is really old. So yeah, hope you enjoyed uh, seeing this in my somewhat in inept abil abilities at playing as the alien, but I think I did well. Praetor Rain is alright in my book. So yeah, I've been Old Nile. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in one of my following videos.